Yeah. Look, look how excited Jimmy is. The <laughs> elder statesman's like an 18-year-old. You're like a kid at Christmas, and we're just fans like you, and we always say that this is your snooker station. I think we prove it with the amount of tournaments we cover. Nobody can match us, but we want this year's World Snooker Championship not just to be about the fans just below my feet, but you at home to be involved every step of the way. We're going to start very easy. We're going to have you an interactive element every day that you get involved and you influence what we do here. But straight up, who's going to win this year's World uh, Championship. We obviously can't have every you know, 32 people to vote for, so we went with the top four and other. I'm really excited to see how far other goes, but you get to start the votes. So how brilliant is that? Uh, Neil, you got to do it just mm. for fun. Well, Jimmy went through almost every player in the tournament just now, <laughs> right? Um, I've mentioned Mark Allen, but I, I think that if I could pick one player to win it, look, Judd Trump for me, he's going to win the world title more than once. In the last two years, he's been the best player. As Jimmy said, he's won five ranking events this year. So I'm going to go with Judd Trump. I think he's got a nice draw. Someone's going to have to beat him when you get to the longer matches. That's going to be tough. So look what's happened. It's live already. We've, we've hit the button and I've never seen this. So this is this is coming up as live. Eurosport.com slash vote. I wanted to give you the first vote. They didn't let you, which I absolutely <laughs> love live television. Jimmy, doesn't even matter now. They're all ahead of you. Who are you going for? I'm going for Ronnie O'Sullivan. OK, he's got to find his touch and feel, but he's going for his seventh world title. So he's my man. Look at this. Look at this.